It may come as a surprise to some, but at this point in time, there is no forensic institute in Lagos. It's formed part of the testimony on cross-examination today of a forensic pathologist and chief medical examiner of the Lagos State University Teaching Hospital, Professor John Obafua, who was testifying at the continuation of the coroner's inquest into the Dana air crash of June 3rd, 2012, which killed all 153 passengers on board and several others on the ground. Professor Bafuma was answering questions from the council to Dana Airline, Bolaji Ayorinde, who sought to know how many people worked in the Forensic Institute of Lagos, which the professor heads as chief medical examiner. After the pathologist, the director of flight operations of Dana Air, Captain Oscar Wilson, took to the witness box and testified under cross-examination that the crashed air aircraft had a cable fault which was fixed on June the 1st. The aircraft came out after an A-check, which is done after every 400 hours of flight. And on June the 2nd, the witness said he handled the first flight at 7 a.m. to ensure that everything was okay with the aircraft before it finally crashed on Sunday the 3rd. At this point, the proceedings were stalled when the counsel to the Lagos State Government, Mr. Kinjide Bakari, requested for the personal logbook of the captain. The document was unavailable in court, and Captain Wilson was ordered to produce it at the next adjourned date of April the 18th.